I saw this video from proud bisnak boy ang Colchito Samontina. Serious ba? Serious ba tawag? Ano may plano ni Mugyo? And here's how to create that angry steaming red face effect using CapCut and it's free. So let's tap on our video track. Look for duplicate. Now with the duplicate track selected, tap on remove BG. Select custom removal. Here we will be removing everything except for the face of the subject. To do that, tap on brush and brush on the face of the subject. You will see that it will be highlighted in red. If in case you included a part outside of the face, then you can tap on erase. Keep doing it until you have something like this. You can also tap on the preview button to check the output. If you're happy, tap on check. You should have something like this. Now tap on the back arrow and look for overlay. Then drag the overlay track to the left and align with the main track. The reason why we made a duplicate copy of just the face is for us to make changes that will only affect the subject's face. Now let's do the angry red fill effect. Tap on the overlay track. Look for Adjust, go to Graphs, select Red, and move the upper dot to the left, and you should have something like this. Tap Check, and this time let's look for Mask. Select Horizontal, then tap Invert. So here we'll be animating the red fill so it looks like it's going from the neck up to the head. So let's place our mask right below the neck, then add a keyframe. If you want to learn more about keyframes, I have 11 video recordings where I discussed keyframes and its use cases. Check the pinned post on my Facebook page. Now move to the part where you want the animation to stop, move the mask up, and place it above the face. It will add another keyframe automatically. You should have something like this. Now let's add that ear smoke. To do that, make sure nothing is selected. Move your playhead to the part where the red face animation is complete. Then tap on overlay, add overlay. Select the ear smoke green screen. You can download this from the link in my bio. Now look for remove BG, select chroma key. Place the color picker on the green area and adjust the intensity and shadow as needed. Move the smoke and position it beside the ear, then adjust the size as needed. Now to do it on the other ear, just hit the back arrows, then look for duplicate. Then long press to drag down, and align it with the first green screen track. Now tap on the duplicate green screen track, Look for Transform, then select Mirror to flip the smoke. Now move it beside the other ear. You should have something like this. Add some sound effects, export, and here's your final output. Follow for more.